I'm here for TV.com with uh, Peter Serfinowicz and Robert Popper of the series Look Around You, which is coming out on DVD soon. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the show? It's a spoof of um, old science education programs that we made to watch when we were little kids in the 70s and 80s, and it's very silly. What is it about those programs that you find so evocative and so rife for satire? Uh, I, I think they were so weird, you know? They were just like super weird, and you're also watching them as a kid, so it's like, you know, when you get all this information as a kid, it's like adults telling you how the world is, you know? Mm -hmm. and, uh, and when they do it in a spooky way, I don't know, is that Because also, we, we, we were made to watch them, I think, like in America at school, mm -hmm. and you were kind of told, we're going to watch a program today, kids, and we thought, fantastic. <laughs> no schoolwork, fantastic. Yeah, yeah. They wheel in the big cupboard with the TV and the only video recorder. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic, no work. And as soon as the program started, it was, during this program, you'll be required to take down notes from the screen. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Work. God. It's like working through a TV show. Is there a process for coming up with like the weird names and the weird sort of faux scientific words that you have in the show? Because there's a ton. There is a ton. It's pronounced forks, by the way. <laughs> oh. And it's tone sorry, instead me. of tongue. Yeah. <laughs> well, we, we, we used to have like a list, didn't we? We add words on lists. Yeah. We did, yeah. We did long like word sessions, didn't we, with kind of silly words. Yeah, I guess. Look around you. Look around you. Just look around you. Have you worked out what we're looking for? Correct. The answer is... Maths. Yeah. As far as the show being on YouTube for a while, because that's how a lot of people sort of discovered it before it was on Adult Swim. Sure. Was that did that not bother you that it was out there just sort of for free? Oh no, we loved it. Mm -hmm. we, we loved the fact that it was getting to you know America, because we, yeah, we well, it's right. such a British show, and we thought, well, first of all, it was such a weird show. We thought, number one, is anyone in Britain going to like it? And they did, which was nice. And then mm -hmm. would Americans get this? And they kind of seem to do, you know. Yeah. And it's great seeing all the comments on YouTube, sort especially even... the ones that go, "Is this real? I think it's meant to be." Well, that's interesting because we didn't. Grow up having those those exact you know sure. series and you guys have the very specific memories of it and we have similar things but have yeah. you found that Americans have sort of taken to it like British people have yeah they have I think even more actually yeah I think maybe I it's because it's sort of exotic because it's British as well I think yeah because yeah. we are very exotic we're so exotic. <laughs> very exotic gentlemen thank you very much uh, thank you guys I, this has been great and uh, look around you on DVD that's right thank you, very thank much. you.